All right. Yeah, we're back playing Candlekeep. What do you, Dano? You were good at recaps. What happened mm -hmm. last time? Um. What was his name? It was something so silly. What was Falthrax, uh, right? No, not Falthrax. Xerox? Xerox, yeah. <laughs> it started out with the Xerox getting a foot massage. Yeah. Uh, yeah. We were already in the thick of things. Um, we were already deep into uh, the plot in Restful Lily, long story short. Ten years ago, uh, the, o the previous owner of the Restful Lily went missing, or uh, so we learned. And the current owners have been doing some dubious things to the current, uh, what's the word I'm looking for? Patrons of, Patrons, uh, yeah. of the Restful Lily. And people have been getting sick. We are here because we are looking for uh, a dwarf named Falthrax, who we found as a very old man. Um, I'm also wrestling him. Yeah, yeah, oh, you're, uh, he's helping us. Actually. Yeah, 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 he's kicking the dude in the shins. <laughs> yeah, yeah so right. um, we found Falthrax. Uh, various things happened. We befriended a, a water elemental uh, that has has been helping us, uh, and we are currently in in battle in combat with uh, the owners of the Restful Lily, the current illicit owners of the Restful Lily. Um, I think uh, Tragana's down. Yeah, we, uh, yeah. we just uh, took down one of the uh, owners. That There's was the last the thing that happened. Is, yeah, I think Nencho had taken down one of the owners, and uh, the Sirena, the Nyad, had cast Hypnotic Pattern over the entire mm. crowd. And so That's now right. we're finding out like who is charmed and who isn't. Uh, Nencho... We did that. I, and I think, what? Yeah, or I, I mean, well, I don't know if you know for sure, but yeah, you know that you aren't. Both of you aren't. Yeah. Uh, it does look like that Xerox is. And then we roll over and it's Kenjamin's turn. Oh man, okay. I'm pretty badly hurt here. Let me start mm -hmm. hag battle music. And I just got a message from Randy saying he's getting on in a second, so we won't be without him All very right. long. Nice. Okay. Hmm. Okay, so hang on, question. Just because I know you guys probably don't remember, but another one of the owners came outside and I think disappeared. And I think that's the last thing that happened. Do you guys remember Not that? No, oh, I sure. don't. Re I don't really remember that because there there's four owners. I remember right? somebody. I remember somebody appeared from out of nowhere. Okay, but I don't and remember I, somebody disappeared. There's this that lady down her. here that had the dog, and then is is Sayeth not one of the owners? Is he just working for them? He's the, he he's just the works for them. Okay, well, okay. no, yeah, I guess yeah, it was just the one that ran out and then appeared out of nowhere. Gotcha. Okay. Yeah. Perfect. Okay. Um, Dano, how are you on health? How's Ninja? Let's see. I think I was doing okay. Um, I'm, I'm about. Uh, I'm not bloodied yet. I've taken a hit or two. Yeah. But uh, I'm not looking too bad yet. I, I can okay. also. I also have abilities to heal myself. Okay. If I really right, need right. to. Well then. Let's see here. What do I have? Uh. What do I have? Uh. Mostly. Oh, healing stuff. I'll be right um, back. Yeah. There he is. Damn it. Wait, did I use my second level spells? My third um, level spells? Uh, I feel like it's been cast as something. Maybe I was using my healing word as third level spells, and that's why I was healing so much. Possibly. Let's go up and see. It could be. I mean, it looks like you've got two two third level spell slots left. Yeah, it looks like you did a first level cure wounds. Oh, okay. Oh, I'm reading it. I'm reading it backwards. Uh, I don't have any first level spells. There you go. Oh. You still got the big guns. You still got yeah, the big yeah. guns. Yeah. And I'm saving I'm saving my second level restoration for the dog. I want I want you to know that right now. Oh. <laughs> Well, we'll see. I've, I, yeah, we'll see about that. I think the dog I've, is not too happy with us. I forgot. I didn't realize that 
the dog being poisoned really is just a debuff that it has, and it doesn't have to not fight you at all. So, like, we'll it see what happens. Advantage. Oh, and yeah. Randy's here. Boom! Boom! We got Randy. We just hey, started right. things up, so you haven't really missed anything. Yeah. All um, right, yeah, I'm sorry, guys. I didn't know you were starting at 6 no, tonight. No, it's my fault. I didn't really tell you a time, so it's all good, dude. <laughs> all right. I am going to cast this. Chablau! Ooh, that's a good one. What did you cast? Spirit Guardians. Oh, oh, you're casting Spirit Guardians. Okay, all my, I guess... All my peeps are unaffected by it. So did you pull... Do you have a template that you put down? I don't know what, a, what I would use. It's just like, I just have uh, a spirits that aura. they well, flit around me to a distance. So I guess they're just floating around me. I don't know. Well, there's in the chat, there's a button for place, measured, oh, place template. measured template. So like the area okay. that you're casting it on. And it says you choose who it affects. Yeah. So who who is that? I assume just all the I bad am. people. Ooh. No worries, yeah. puppy. No worries, pup. What is, um, what is it now? But, but Falkrath, Falkrath is unaffected, and so is Nensho, and so is Xerox. Everybody what do these each spirits? Oh, and, oh, that's a good one. What and, do these spirits and, look like? So for me, they just look angelic, I'm pretty sure. Uh, okay. I'm not well, sure. Can they, can they just be like New York taxi drivers? Just as much the construction workers. <laughs> like, hey! <laughs> hey! Hey! You hey, trying to walk just... in here? You need to go slower! Uh, They're just also, walking I don't in want circles. <laughs> Sorry, go ahead, Kevin. I don't want the water lady affected as well. So I pretty much I just want like the people that are attacking us to be affected. Okay, faux show. Sure. Uh, all right. Uh, I guess click the damage button. Did you target anybody? It doesn't matter if you did, but no, I haven't yet. Should I? It's whenever they fail their saves, they have to roll it. So like yeah. whenever they enter, I assume on their turn. Oh, and it's, and it's half. Or Unless you want to just roll, there, it, must roll make a it wizard once saving throw. and then have it do it for every time. Well, I'm just, it, just because it, it automates stuff, so a lot of times okay. it's already... Okay, so it looks like you did target them, I think. Oh, I don't know. I targeted a lot of people, it looks like. It's all good. I'll just click the ones that are bad. Okay. Oh, no. Do I have to do a saving throw? I don't think so. Oops. It says, uh, for me, it says your GM has requested rolls from your character. It was just because just, you guys got targeted accidentally, so okay, you can oh, exit okay. it out. Yeah, just click the X. Because he specified that you aren't affected by it. Got it. Oh, whoa, what's rolling? Oh, okay. These are all, oh my lordy. Okay. Whew, that's a lot of rolls right there. What's your save DC, Kevin? Like 15? probably high as shit. Yeah, it, it already, it's a fourteen. It's a, it's already okay. automatically doing. I'm just reading what's happening with it. Sure. Gotcha. Okay. Um. Cool. Well, they're all there. Great. And then that's your turn, Kenjamin Healy's. So you got your movement if you want. Ah, uh, yeah, but I did opportunity of attack. Oh man, wow. pulled up Yosef on accident. Oh. Oh man, why is Yosef getting pulled up? Um, <laughs> I'm not sure. Um, hmm. I guess. Uh, I think I'm done. I can't click myself for some reason. Really? Yeah. Oh. I don't know what just happened. Another layout. Oh, probably because you were in layout mode. Oh, Can you do I have two now? of them? It looks like another one got laid down, yeah. Oh, okay. Oh, I see. <laughs> Am I still in layout mode? Oh, man. I don't know. I just deleted them. Okay. Yeah, I got, I got to select myself. I just needed to see if I have a bonus action, but I don't think I do. Mm, no, I don't. So that is my turn. All right. Concentration? That is your turn. No, it just happens. Uh, 
All right, so next turn, it is this one of the bosses who is south of you, Kenjamin, uh, is standing there and I guess just yells out. Where is she? A little help, please. She yells back through the doorway and as loud as she can. Uh, and then she turns around to you guys and she just goes. Does to she cast have to. Does she, does she start in my. Spirit Guardians? She, she does. So she does take the damage from that. Okay. Cool. Actually, I'm just going to apply it to everyone because they all are going to start there no matter yeah, what. Yeah, their turn. Yeah. Okay, cool. All applied. Um, so she goes to cast a spell. What? Okay, this is bad. <laughs> well, it's not letting me zoom out. Oh, whatever. Uh-oh. All right, in a 40-foot cube, everyone just starts to feel bogged down by time. Never! I'm too oh. wise from the streets of New York. Can't be hypnotized. Yeah, no. Someone got a 20. It's a ridiculous overlay. <laughs> Oh, it looks like you threw that for me. Uh, well, if it asks you and then gives you so much time to click the button, and if it oh, does it, okay. auto does it. All right. So, is it going to give me the buttons for it? Pretty sure All right. I so we've got Nencho fails, Xerox succeeds, Kenjamin succeeds. All right. Wonderful. Let me get rid of this. Success. And then, and then she, I guess she notices that you're not slowed down, Kenjamin, and then she she books it away from you. You have an opportunity to attack if you want it. Yep. Oh, you know it, son. Where is it? There it is. Hit her with the mace. Ooh. Nice. Oh, two. Oh, damn. oh, you swing and she she's just too quick. Damn. All right. Uh, great. So then that happens. Let's see. Uh, and then Ilmar runs outside yeah. and is looking around, seeing what's going on. Uh, looks over at her. She's running away, and uh, I guess he, he he actually sees the sun like beams down at him, and he just covers he covers his eyes. He can barely see, uh, but he he goes to cast a spell just blindly out in that direction. Oh, nice. And her body starts to glow, and everyone has advantage on attacks against her. Ooh. Pretty sure. Any attack roll against it has advantage. Yep, okay, cool. Okay, here, let's get him out of the order. Who is this? Maybe Green Song did show up because she came out with her dog, right? It's her with the dog, isn't it, Green Song? Right. So, okay, uh, like, yeah, did she... you see her with the dog? Because yeah, yeah, you're I, right. We, and then she disappeared somewhere. That's right. Okay. Okay. Well, as long as yeah, if you remember her disappearing, then that sounds legit. Um, okay. So we got. Uh... Uh, 
Uh, Xerox, it is your turn. What are you doing? Hmm. Sorry, I'm eating. <laughs> <laughs> oh, sorry, um, gotcha. Um, let's see. I'm re-familiarizing myself with what's going on here. Hell yeah. Uh, so... So this person up here is... You guys just knocked them out. Oh, actually, right. I'm sorry. It's your turn, but you're... You were charmed under under the, the crazy hypnotic pattern that was cast over the battlefield. Um, so I guess you're just charmed right now. Can she... I think he saves at the end of his turn. Okay. So I, I think it's a wisdom... Do a wisdom saving throw. Wisdom saving throw, gotcha. That's under checks? Oh, no, under saves. Saves, right. yeah. Wisdom saving. Thirteen does not save. Not strong enough. No, not for her. Well, but so does that last for like a certain amount of time? And but then... it's an ally who is charming the group. So like, I wonder if she can selectively let you out of it. Is it well, just like all targets, or can she choose? I don't no, know. No, because I think it. it's concentration on the spell, and she can't. It doesn't say that she can choose. So yeah, unfortunately, that was a downside to her doing that. She has control over Saith. Um, I guess over Saith, but you're still controlled. Sorry, okay. Rando. <laughs> you, can, no you can continue eating, I guess. Uh, so you're <laughs> incapacitated. Um. Okay, no, it says it, it ends for an affected creature if it takes any damage or someone else uses an action to shake the creature out of its stupor. Oh, okay. Oh. okay. So someone could shake damage. you out. Well, did she take damage from my spirit guardian? No, it was our ally that, uh, it was the water spirit. Oh. Yeah, it was Cyrene oh, who did it, so you didn't cast, you didn't attack her. <laughs> um... Okay, well, yeah, but I guess you guys, uh, yeah, I mean, you can probably shake him free. Dun, dun, dun. Okay. okay, so Morgana, you know what, she's a big deal. I'm going to roll her some stuff. You don't know what's happening there. All right. Um, and then you guys see the gargoyle from up in the room where you met Falthrax emerge from the door of the tower. Uh, he saw through the, the old lady gargoyle play, huh? <laughs> <laughs> Eventually. It took until now. Yeah. <clears throat> All right. And then out of nowhere, Green Song appears and comes at Actually, oh, I should have rethought about this. She actually appears here. Oh, he's still following her. Uh, and comes at Nunch, because Nencho just attacked her sister, or whatever it is. Um, so she appears and just grabs your head and just tries to fuck you Man, up with necrotic damage. Grabbing me. Stop. Get off of me. Get out of here! Yes! Ooh, you succeed, and so that you was only take so close to 13, 13 necrotic damage bloodying you. Okay. Oh, shit. Um, and then... Oh, well... Yeah, I guess stays there. All right. Uh, well, yeah, stays there. All right. Um, then it is this person's turn. Who is this? All right. Uh, 
This guy runs out into the fray, uh, coming in and attacking Kenjamin. Oh, my oh you ain't getting healed no more, pups. Uh, are these guys, like, controlled versions of, uh, like, the patrons? <laughs> no, these yeah, are just guy. other workers. Like, oh you saw, God. this this guy you saw giving a foot massage earlier. Might be bad. <laughs> okay. So comes well, in we are Kenjamin with his somebody. claws. Ooh, slashing you for three damage. Uh, and Oh, what is the wisdom? Ooh, and you are now frightened of this motherfucker. Who? You. Of who? Oh, of the guy who just ran out to your right. Thomas Jefferson oh. guy. <laughs> yeah, this Thomas Jefferson is freaking you out. <laughs> Wait, how long are your is your are your spirit guardians continual? Yeah. Mm -hmm. Oh, and then we deleted the, so uh, he, the extra one. Whoops. Okay. Yeah. So he entered my zone. He entered 36. your zone. Yeah. How? Let's put another one down. Hang on. Um, how big was it? Fifteen oh. feet. And he had it centered right there. It's like centered, yeah. Like that. Yeah. All right. Cool. All right. Okay. So yeah, I guess he enters your area, and he take. How do you? He's did she? Make... Did Green Song take the damage too? Yeah, she originally did. And they have uh, to make a Wisdom save, wisdom I think. Wisdom saving throw. Yeah. And it's three d six, have to save. Yeah. Three d eight. Ooh. What is it that's doing this? Spirit Guardian. Should I roll 3d8 again? Well, I'm seeing if this will... Yeah, just roll 3d8 in the, the chat. Slash roll 3d8. Yep. Slash R, or the, you can hit a d8 down below, and it'll add a 3, 4, ooh, okay. Holy shit. Okay, yeah, it takes a bunch of damage, comes in, attacks you with whatever, with the, the claw attack. You're frightened of it now. Uh, and then actually goes towards Xerox with another claw. Oh, do it. Get your fucking nerdy claws out of here. Ooh. And hits for six slashing. You're gonna have to do a wisdom save, or this guy's freaking you out. Fourteen. That's a success. So you are not scared of this guy. He ain't tough. Hit, right? uh, okay, so he runs in Falthrax. Oh shit. Uh, Falthrax steps out of the Spirit Guardian. Wait, Spirit Guardians He's aren't charmed. affecting him, right? Falthrax is charmed. Oh, yeah, he is and charmed. It, he and, can't do and, shit. Uh, it doesn't affect, the Spirit Guardians doesn't affect him either. And okay. I think Morty needs to go back over here, I think? He was, like, here. Because he is, like, Where's, following. Oh, yeah, because he's following. Hang on, let me unlink that. You right, he's... Oop, oop. <coughs> All right, cool. Um, blah, she's running in. What's your speed? Ooh, okay. Alright. 
So I'll say that this gargo gargoyle flies out the door and hits your spirit guardian. So it's going to do its wisdom save. Ooh, okay. Uh, so if you want to roll that damage, Hell Benjamin. Yeah. Holy shit, this is fucked up how much damage this does. All right, that's really good. Area denial. Yeah! Ooh, yes! Whoa! All right. 20 damage to this guy. Uh, and then it immediately turns right to get out of the way. Um, isn't really near anybody and is just kind of like floating there. Um, actually chooses to fly around because it can dash now. Um, all right, Morty's turn. More tea, poor dog, wants to get to Green Song, so... He's also charmed. Oh yeah, he can't move, you're right, he's charmed. So he can't do shit, he's just chilling there in place. Oh yeah, Saith is charmed. Uh, Sirena. Mmm... Mm. Well, I got off. What do you guys think? Hang, or hang on, or let go of them. I've got a couple. It looks like I've got one of them. Hang on to them. Okay, it just means I've got one of your guys too. All right. She's I hanging on. I think I'll on. solve that next turn. Aha! All right, Nencho, it is your turn. Um, I am going to use my bonus action to use my second wind. Oh, yeah. Oh, that's real good. I needed that. Okay. Why? So I heal, heal, heal myself up a little bit. I'm going to move my guy here. I'll take the opportunity attack from Greensong if she's got it. Okay. Yeah, she claws at you. And scrapes you in the back as you run. Hit me. Ooh, for 12 slashing. Jesus. Damn. Man. All right. And then I say, sorry, Xerox. And then I use my breath weapon. Ooh, uh, okay. It's going gonna, it's gonna to hit. It's going to hit Sight. me. It's gonna hit Sayeth, it's gonna hit Xerox, it's gonna hit Greensong, and it's gonna hit uh, the corpse of uh, Morgana, hopefully knocking her down some uh, saving throws. Oh, sure. Is it giving you a template to put down for it? It is not giving me nothing, no. I guess it's not. Okay. Um... Or, I, you know what, I think I clicked the wrong one. Do I have one that's actually, like, consumes a thing? No, oh, it just says under action. Yeah, under inventory weapons, breath weapons. Uh, it so. is inventory. It is inventory. Okay, here we go. There we go. And there is a. Wait. Oh wait. Can I rotate it? No, you it could wouldn't have. let me. Oh. <clears throat> it's all right. Well. No worries. Whoa, all right. Oh, why are you breathing on Falcons? I know. <laughs> you just blew. Falcons. Uh. No, it... Actually, I might cool. ask to do it again just so yeah. it can automate more. Yeah. Uh, the scroll wheel will spin it around. Will you uh, refresh my breath weapon? Yeah, let's see here. I thought if like I held the click, I could drag it to whatever mm -hmm. thing, and it, that is not how it works. <laughs> totally. <laughs> Alright, I think it should be good. Okay. Oh. It looks like it was, but it's, it's not letting me... It's saying one out of one on the left side, but on the right side, it's saying zero out of one. Um... Here, let's, let's do it like this. Yeah, I think I figured it out. Okay. 
Hell yes. All right, and then click the damage, and it should automate a bunch of this. Constitution saving throw for a bunch of these people. All right. Oh, yeah, you're dead. Okay, so, uh, Xerox, you are hit. This, this coal, it's, uh, I guess, it, what is it? Is it fire? It's a, it's a, it's a, it's a, cold, it's a cold cone of uh, icy breath. So you're just like looking at this pretty thing in the sky, and then all of a sudden. Stop, <laughs> <laughs> Xerox! <laughs> but you come to, you, you snap out of oh. it. The, the pretty colors in the sky are now gone, and you're getting burned, but you're conscious. Oh. Hey, what's going on? Oh, shit, my skin. <laughs> oh, no. <laughs> and then, I think, uh, I think that's my turn. All right. Hell yeah, what a turn it was. <laughs> All right. All right, Benjamin, I could use some of them healings you were talking about before. You know I got your back, homie. I gotta have something at least. Kenjamin, what are you up to? Man, I'm up to lots of stuff, man. Let's see it. You're, <laughs> yeah, I guess, oh, hang on. Is there anybody? Okay, no, no one's been affected by your spirit guardians, but they're still spinning around. That's what I'll do. Dano, I'm going to cast your wounds. I guess I have to come over there. Where are you? I'm like, you can step right here. And he won't take ops because... Actually, he's, he, he's he's probably not charmed anymore since I hit him with the uh, hmm. breath weapon. Oh, fuck yeah. Uh, what, what color are you, Kevin? Uh, what? What color are your spirit guardians? Oh, uh, yellow. All right. Um, Jaxi cab yellow. Blue, yellow, I guess. It's the only thing with yellow in it. All right. I'll just do that. Actually, I don't I don't have to. I'll just do healing word. Pretty. How do I cast? How do I cast up? Like, how Whoa. do I use healing Oh, you're a, a higher just level? Like, That's a good... Question. Does it, like, whenever you click it, does it uh, bring oh, up it, options of, like, templates and stuff? You know what I mean? Like, right. that pre. You can change it after you click it. After I click it? Mm hmm. There should be, like, some drop downs after you click it. It's, like, usability. Like, it's confirming whether you want to use it. There might be, like, I options gotcha, below gotcha. it. Where are you at? There you are. Wow. Roll. Cast at level two. Boom. Nice. And then click the healing for the for the field dudes. Oh no! <laughs> Still nine. Still pretty That's, good. No, it's better than I had. Healing word is is a. Uh, it is what it is. Yeah. But I'm, I'm, I'm taking it. All right, Kenjamin, what else? Uh, that's that's all. Uh, is healing word a action? It's a bonus healing action. Healing word's action. a bonus action, yeah. Wow! Yeah. So now I'm going to fucking donk this dude upside of the head. You going to donk a dude? Shoot. Donk. I'm going to donk a dude with my mace. Yeah. Woo! And Have at it. Hit. That hits him. You come down with that at that motherfucker. Get punk, Washington. <laughs> he got hit hard by that Spirit punk. Guardian too. Wow. Hell yeah, you slam this this dude. Uh Yeah, you you, you slam him. Uh slam and jam him. And he's hurting. He just he's he's frowning. All right, is that your turn? That's my turn. All right. Um, so she's over here. 
And she is gonna... Oh, yeah. Oh, what's the distance on that, though? It's probably touch, isn't it? Oh, no. It isn't. What's the, my distance here? Perfect. Uh, okay, so she takes aim at Kenjamin and, and, and utters some words, and a spell comes flying out towards you, buddy. Target you. And you're gonna have to do. Oh, God. Wow. Damn it. You feel your body changing form, uh, 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 but you fight it. And you are still the Kenjamin we all know and love. Yeah. She says. Uh, and then she just runs towards the edge here. Uh, but her body is still glowing. Ilmar is there. Ilmar, what do you got? Fuck. I mean, he takes Where's aim with his crossbow. At? Huh? Where's glowy lady over here? To the left. She's like over, over here. She ran off. Oh, okay. Yeah, she may be behind trees. Or no, you should be able to see her. Yeah. Uh, see but you. Ilmar is just like trying to shield his eyes from the sun is just like haphazardly aiming his crossbow over towards her. Ooh, badly. It just goes flying out way to the north. Totally not, nowhere near her. Um, Step back inside and shoot from inside next time. He just shrugs. Uh, okay. Uh, Who's this? Who are you? Okay, great. Shit. Okay, so he runs oh, to the duty. door. Got I'm going to give him a perception check. Uh, yeah, he's, uh. Okay, cool. Just runs right outside. If you want to roll... Oh, well, hang on. Let me give him a save. A D6. What kind of save is 3D8. it? It's a wisdom? Wisdom. No, my piece. My dab rig. <laughs> oh, no, that. Yeah. I have a D6 for that one. All right. Another. Yeah, another chunk of damage. 3D6, if you would. What? Well. 3D8, isn't it? Is it 8? For your uh, spirit guardians? 3D8? It's 3D8 for my spirit guardians. Well, if you would, roll another chunk of damage for this guy yeah. who's stepped out. Sorry. No, I was talking about my, my dab rig. It looks like a D6. Oh. <laughs> Oh, that looks fancy. Look at that. Yeah. And you? Did you just get that? Yeah. I think it is brand new. Sounds new. What? 19. Is oh, your look. toy new? Oh, it's not. No, uh, but Julie just boiled it, so it's all oh. fresh and good. Uh, and you guys, you guys noticed that this guy, like, blood, instead, like, it, where blood would spurt out, instead is just like a puff of like dust and like straw shoots out oh man yeah i don't Walls. know if this matters i wouldn't think it does but it's radiant damage my spirit guardians okay let me double check if it does although it i mean the yeah, system should the automatically anything. look for that stuff too so yeah, yeah yeah looks like nope nothing about that um he can get around him Well, no. You know what? He's just gonna... Oh, shit. No, he can't get into that spot. <coughs> no, yeah, fine. He comes there, and he's just attacking Ilmar. No, wait. He doesn't know... <coughs> no, he runs around Ilmar, and he uh, attacks Kenjamin. Actually, you know what? When he runs into your spirit guardians, it like shears off the skin on his face and it's just like a burlap sack and he runs up to you and he just screams in your face, Kenjamin. Uh, and you, you gotta do some sort of save here, buddy. You're scared shitless of this dude. Scarecrow something. 
Although you're just too smart for him. You you hold your ground. I'm street, no big deal. I'm street wise from, from New York. <laughs> I've seen it all. I've seen giant rats eating pizza. You should have been to Baldur's Gate. It's way different out there. You're nothing. <laughs> you're nothing. Oh, more people? <laughs> Fuck. This is a party. I know. Tons of people keep running it. And this, this woman who's running up from behind the bushes carrying a whole tray of glasses just throws it over her shoulder into the trees the, the glasses are breaking and shattering xerox it's your turn uh yeah um let's see here <laughs> uh i kind of want to let's see what i got here Uh, I want to move out of this commotion first of all. And... Okay, okay. Um, so keep in mind that you will instigate opportunity attacks from the bad guys who are within five feet of you. But you can totally, if you choose to use your action to disengage, then you can get out of there without anyone hitting you. Okay, but and then I basically, I would, would I be outside of this angel tornado thing? You uh, you could use all of your movement, which is 30 feet, so you could you, get outside of that. I mean, the... You want to be in the angel tornado. That's that's good. It's hitting all the bad guys oh, while yeah, you're in there. Yeah. yeah. Oh, gotcha. Yeah. But, oh. like, this guy, this guy, and this guy are all, like, enemies. So yeah. if you move out of there, like... Like, if you move away from next to them, so, like, you can move here and be not be hit by this guy right here, but these, both of the guys on the left side would get a hit on you. Okay, so maybe I should just stick where I'm at. And... Got any juicy the... spells? Yeah, I was gonna say, what is the knock spell here? That just opens up doors. It's probably not oh, okay. useful in battle. It opens up locked doors, though. Yeah, good stuff. Cool. I want to use the hideous laughter one so bad, but I don't know if that's really appropriate here. You, oh, it's a yeah, good you spell. Can. Yeah, use that shit. It? It, it, it forces your enemies to cackle in uncontrollable laughter. <laughs> yeah, we definitely want to use that. You, like you tell a funny joke and they cannot help themselves but just, just laugh themselves <laughs> until it hurts. <laughs> oh, Not a bad I got, spell. I got, I, got, I got a target, I guess, someone here. If you targeted Greensong, she's a spellcaster and that would like, if she was laughing, she wouldn't be able to like cast spells on us either, so that could be really useful. <laughs> Yeah, that's who I was going to target here. So I kind of look over. I'm like, hey, um, what? Do you, uh, shit, I don't know any good jokes off the top of my damn head. <laughs> um, basically, I tell a really funny joke. Well, you wanted to use knock, so just do you knock, knock. <laughs> yeah. I'm like, hey, knock, knock. She's like, who's there? I'm like, it's laughter. And then it's just it's laughter. 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 <laughs> Ooh, she succeeds, unfortunately. Uh. So she you, she just kind of laughs, and you're like, oh. But she's just like, <laughs> no, I'm just laughing at how incompetent you are at magic. <laughs> Although it's my save that saved, whatever. Uh, okay, cool. So you, you cast that at her. You try to make her laugh. Uh, do you have anything else? Let's look at. Use your got. bonus action to inspire somebody, probably. Oh yeah. Yeah, I guess I could do that. Um. You've got one more, but yeah, you could totally do it. Cool. Um, how about I inspire Kenjamin down here? Oh, okay. Yeah. Kenjamin, what, what do you say I to inspire him? Um. Give him a compliment. 
Yeah, I'm like, hey, Kenjamin, uh, your your sunglasses look real cool tonight. And then I, and he's like, oh hell yeah. Yeah. I don't. How do you do that though? You would click on him and then click your bardic inspiration. You so you would target Kenjamin and then uh. Bardic inspiration. I think it's under oh, features. Yeah. I got it. Yeah. All right. Well, cool. Yeah. So you can you can add it whenever. I mean, you'll he'll roll it, I guess. So yeah, cool. Uh, Kenjamin, I guess, actually it probably doesn't even matter if you target or whatever with Bardic Inspiration because it won't apply yeah, until he decides. Sure. Sure. Uh, but oh, awesome. So you yeah, that's an awesome turn. All right, Morgana is uh, yeah dying. Okay. Did, did she die? Because I hit her with my breath, so she would have instantly taken two death saves from getting hit. Oh, okay. Two death saves? I'm pretty sure that's how it works. If you're if you're incapacitated and here, let's let's. Double I check think it's it. just one death. I think you're for sure right <laughs> about <laughs> one of be, them. It might, be, it might be one. Uh, incapacitated. You just automatically fail. Let's see. Any attack that hits the creature is a critical hit if the attacker is within five feet of the creature. And I think, uh, let's see. Or here, actually, let's look up death saving throws. If you take any damage while you have zero hit points, you suffer a death saving throw failure. If the damage is from a critical hit, you suffer two failures. Ah, uh, okay, the critical combined. Okay, then awesome. Yeah, then she is donezo. I... All right, so... No, okay, okay I, I mixed it up. Any attack that hits a creature is a critical hit if the attacker is within five feet. So if, like... If I'm oh, doing the coup, you weren't five feet. Okay. So she would have got one from the from the dragon breath then. Gotcha. Okay. Okay, that makes sense. All right. All right so, so she's, she's unconscious. Breathing? Okay. She's unconscious right now, uh, and this gargoyle swoops in and is going at Kenjamin in the middle of this group. Um, goes to bite ya. Yikes! <laughs> and you just you swat it away. It goes to claw ya. Jeez, it's just, it's distracted by everyone who's around. Um, did it take damage whenever it answered his, uh... Uh, yeah, it did. I think, yeah, boy, I let's get, get that 3d8, son. Oh, well, hang on, what's the save it's gotta beat? Wisdom, 14. 14. Okay, it beats it, so it, I guess it, what's it take, half? Half, it takes half, half, yeah. Okay. Half damage... Its All speed right. is also halved whenever it enters. Whew! Okay. All right. That's good to know. All right. So. This spell is going to win us the fucking fight, Kevin. I know, right? Well, let's <laughs> uh, All right. So Greenzong starts her turn here. So she's going to do a wisdom save for the. Three, D three more D8, Kevin. It started its started turn there, right? Yeah, yeah. yeah. You're gonna have to do it like three times here coming up. <laughs> yeah, it's only if they start their turn in there. Yeah, so it's her turn now, and then the dog isn't gonna start her turn, but he might enter in, and then Sayeth is gonna fucking take it too. Alright, so she I just imagine it's just a bunch it's just a bunch of construction workers in like sweaty hey, hey, hey. shirt. What are you doing? Hey, what are you hey, doing? Hey, what are you hey, doing? Hey, hey, what are you doing? Hey, 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 
Is it asking anyone for saves already? Nope. No, I don't nope. have a save. <clears throat> okay. Oh, I got wisdom. There we go. Should spit me out a readout here. There we go. All right. Come on. Maybe. All right. So let's see what we got. We've got Nencho succeeded. Xerox succeeded, and Kenjiman Healy succeeded. That's all that's really important, and that sucks. All right, great. So she looks pretty uh, upset with that result and starts heading off this way. Um, Xerox, you can take a melee attack against her as she's running away, if you would like. Yeah. Run away. Don't run away. Uh, sorry, how do I do that exactly? Because I don't have the menu thing. Um, oh, well, you could, you should be able to click your token and then it should come up. Oh. Yeah, I forget okay. what happens automatically for you guys and what doesn't. So I basically try to stab her with my dagger. Okay, so yeah, you lunge at her with your dagger, but she just d dives out too quickly. And she gets to there, she does that, that's great. Who this? That guy, he's in the middle of this thing. He's gotta do his save. Yeah, this is bullshit. <laughs> <laughs> Sorry, man. No, it's it's awesome. All these oh, I don't know why different effects going on things. here. Uh, okay, yeah, he gets an, uh, a six, so he fails. Give me that damage. I don't know why it gave me a whiz, so, whiz save. Is this a dog? Oh, okay. No, guy? that's okay. that guy right there. Um, but he's just like right in your face, Kenjamin. Uh, he somehow knows that you're the one who did this to him and he is just clawing at you like a madman. He misses, he goes again. Damn, all these guys are fucking double attacking pieces of shit. Ooh, and he gets you for eight slashing damage. And it, it scares you for a second. Yeah, I'm still maintaining my concentration. Yep. Oh, that I was waiting. Yeah, okay. Dang it. Okay, so yeah, you're still maintaining the spirit guardians, even though you were hit for... Did I do it yet? Yeah. All right. Um, cool, cool. That's that. Turn. What do you have to roll a 10, right, to maintain? It's yeah, either 10, or, 10 or, or half of the damage that you took, whichever's more. So if oh, you take, right. like, 40 damage, you have to roll a 20. Ah, okay. Mm -hmm. But yeah, ten or whatever Falthrax. half the damage is. Falthrax continues to run in here and help. He's charmed, unfortunately. I want him to help, but he's uh, still probably looking yeah, at the dude. thing. Uh oh, wait. Have him do a saving throw, I guess. Hang on, hang on. Let me look at something. Okay. The hypnotic pattern. No. I guess it doesn't take damage. Okay, cool, cool. Uh, so yeah, nope, he can't help. He's stuck there. Gosh, damn it. A staff member steps up into the doorway and... Hmm. 
And I guess Kenjamin's there, but I'm gonna give her disadvantage because there's so much shit in the way, although... Yep, okay. <laughs> she, she just, she goes, psst, hey, psst, psst, to Kenjamin. Psst, look over here. Hey. What? Hey, what? And she makes a scary face at you. Ha <laughs> ha! And you are scared to death of this lady. Uh-oh, you can't get close to her and you can't attack her or something? I can't really move. I think you can't move towards her. And, yeah, uh, right. yeah you can't, and you can't attack her. Let's put it on there. Frightened. All right, so that's her turn. This I mean, gargoyle's you, turn. Um, mm. You have disadvantage on abilities and attack rolls while you can see her. Or frightened. Oh, okay. I knew there was something else to that. Hell yeah. Uh, so this gargoyle swoops in at Serena. <coughs> and bites. What a slog. We got him. I'm gonna do some damage yeah. this next turn, hopefully. Ugh. Ooh, okay. Then a claws. This gargoyle's claw at Serena misses. She maintains her concentration. Um, Morty's turn. Nothing. He's charmed. Um, where are we at? Saith's turn. He's charmed. Uh, so no, I say, turn. it wouldn't actually it, go like that. Say if oh, take because damage, it'd become her turn. Mm -hmm. All right, go back to say. But now, now he has to make another. Uh, he has, you get another three D eight, Kevin. Yeah. With say for it. say you. Yeah. Ooh, is that a crit? Yeah, you got a critical save there. So he takes half of your damage, which is only seven. Three. Hmm. Oh well. <laughs> All right, so saith. Um, ba -ba 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 -ba. I guess he was just burnt by Nencho, so he turns around to Nencho. Um, let me come let me at me, liar! Really quick. Um, okay, so he he runs out here and he goes to grapple. Uh, opportunity Falbrex. attack? Alright, totally take it. Eighteen? Ooh, that misses him. He's oh too my quick. God. He dodges out of the way. Um, oh, uh... Randy, you could take an opportunity to, I think, can all of you? I Actually, think all of you yeah. can. Yeah. 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 Oh, shit. How do I... I just fucked up. Did you? Oh, you got a right. 20. Is that yeah. not what you wanted to swing with? I guess it'll work. No, yeah. but, yeah. It'll do more damage with the longsword. Well, God damn it. What did you mean to do? That's oh, I, fucking tragic. You rolled a 20 was, and a 1. That's fucking yeah. insane. What were you trying to do, Randy? I don't, I don't know. I accidentally clicked on that, though, but it worked out. I'm just getting yeah, attacked that, left and right. That, yeah, that I mean, you know, you it. If you want to click damage on that, if you want to try something else, I'm happy to do that, too, but... That one so did hit, get, so you can take yeah, it if yeah. you want. And max damage. What a beast. Ooh, all right. So yeah, you slice up this guy. Although you're all right there. Give me perception checks. All right, well, Nencho, you notice that that's, those attacks didn't do nearly as much damage as you're used to 
them doing. Okay, so he might be resistant against slashing damage. Uh, we have to hit him with spells or something. He The swords don't work. Maybe arrows, I don't know. Our dude, our main spellcaster with spells that actually do damage is not here. Yeah, I'll learn. <laughs> oh no. <laughs> I'm literally just healing, and I'm all out of spell slots. All right, so he went from here, that's 10 feet. He grabs Falthrax and is, has him grappled and starts like dragging him out this way. He can only get to that point because his distance is half. Oh, well, wait. He can probably only get to here because his distance is supposed to be halved inside of the area. Yep. All right, so yeah, he can, he's but he's grabbing on to Falthrax and he actually like, he puts his hand on his head and he's like, if this is the guy you're after, then I swear to God, I will plane shift this motherfucker into the somewhere in hell. What? What are we gonna do? So that's what Sayeth says to you guys. Uh, Sirena, um, I guess doesn't care about. Yeah, she can drop the pattern now. Yeah, she doesn't need... Well, the pattern's gone, but she's... Yeah, exactly. She can just drop her concentration on that. And she's going to... What's she going to do? Um... Okay, yeah, she, she moves her hands around and see, seemingly casts some sort of spell. Uh, hang on, where is she aiming? Mm. No, sorry, she's not going to do that. Okay, she just turns to the gargoyle and... Just try it. flicks it in the head and misses it, but goes with the other hand. Another flick and chips off a chunk of it. Nice. Wow, psychic damage. All right, um, Nensho, you're up. All right, <clears throat> this guy in front of me is bloodied. I'm going to take a swing with my battle axe at him. This is uh, with advantage since I have... Uh, Flanking with Kevin being right there. Hell yeah. Or so hold yeah. alt. Yep. Okay, cool. Twenty one. Twenty one hits. Oh. Whew. For an amount of slashing damage right there. <laughs> Takes a little All bit. Right. I'm gonna do it again. And with my extra attack. Six. That hits. Nice. Come on, a little bit more this time. Yeah, bits of straw are just like psh, psh, with every hit landing on the ground. Um, let's see, real quick. How am I looking? Shit. I'm going to. Damn it. That wasn't next to three fucking people. Uh, I'm going to use. Yeah, we gotta worry about survival. Um, I'm going to use my bonus action to my last maneuver uh, to use my rally. On uh, Kenjamin. Okay. And that allows him to move without uh, opportunity attack. No, that uh, that uh, actually, um, Kenjamin, hang in there. It gives him a little bit of temporary uh, HP. So yeah. it is a D8 plus my charisma modifier. 
seven plus what is my charisma modifier? So you get nine temporary hit points. Here, I'll add them for you. And then, oh, gosh, I have to. I'm gonna action surge. Okay. And then I'm gonna hit this guy uh, with my battle axe again. Take one of these dudes out. All right, I, w I would have uh, advantage on that, but I'm assuming a 21 is a hit. It does. All right, there's there's a little bit better. Wow. Describe it. Um, as I'm like hacking away at this guy, uh, like I just see the straw flying out, and eventually I take both of my battle axes right in the middle, and I just rip the straw into like from this from the torso. Hell yeah. Um, and then I still have one more attack. I'm going to. Ah oh, shit. I'm gonna turn. How do, what is this? This doesn't look like a regular dog, right? <laughs> uh, it looks like a regular dog. <laughs> I think. This looks like a mastiff or something. You know what? Actually, I'm going to take a movement right there up to him. Um, I'm hoping that the poison will Ooh. prevent some of these ops I'm getting. Uh, but the gargoyle would take an opportunity attack against you. Uh, so, like, if you're poisoned, I think it just gives you disadvantage on attack rolls, if I'm not mistaken. Uh, well, I'm not talking about the dog, I'm talking about the uh, gargoyle. Okay. okay, that's fine. Oh, but he misses you. anyway. Boo. Okay, good, so yeah, good, you good. run outside, you run towards Saith. Alright, and then, uh... I tell him, uh, I, I run up and I say... Say... It doesn't matter, we'll slaughter you all anyway! And then, uh... I'm going to hit him with my last extra attack. Damn it! That that just hits. It does? I rolled a 19 last time and it didn't hit him. No, I think it was an I 18. Thought. Was it? Yeah. I mean, it Let's automatically see. tells me, and yeah, 19 hits. That's his AC, is 19. Okay, good. Did I have the wrong... Oh, it was an 18. Okay. Well. Rah! But good job. Even though slashing doesn't do too much, I'm still hacking away at him. Hopefully, yeah, it does a little bit. Did he just become bloodied? He was already bloodied. Oh, okay. Okay, and is that your turn? I guess. Yeah, that's everything. All right. All right. You know what? Fuck it. That doesn't need to happen. There's already too many people. There was someone still running to the scene. You don't know that. It's fine. <laughs> Kenjamin, what are you doing? Um. So, I guess I'm gonna move right here. Okay. And then right here. Uh. Oh yeah, the gargoyle already used its reaction against. The other uh, against uh, Nencho, so yeah. Oh, oh right. well, no, he's in here. I'm moving right here. Okay. Because I can't see her. So as long as I can't see her, I'm not frightened, right? Uh, right. Yeah. So you don't have the disadvantage. Hell yeah. You are smart dude. Okay. You a smart mofo, man. Look at that. Yeah, I just fucking, I was like, I'm just gonna, blah, blah, blah. All right, now I'm gonna fucking, did I not target? Is this, is this not a bad guy? This That's is a bad, bad guy. guy. I'm trying to select, yeah, I'm trying to select him. It looks like you are. It says you must target at most one tokens. Oh, is who it? else? Maybe you have another oh, one okay. targeted. Yeah, yeah. Yup. Bing bong. Toll of the dead. Toll of the dead. So click your damage. Oh, that's a good one. Damn, what the fuck that shit? Ah. Ooh, 2d12 and I roll five. Blow! Five damage. You just see. Yeah, I guess okay. you. Still good for cancer. Can't be mad. Yeah, you see just oh. rotten hay dripping out. Is that. What else you got, Ken? Kenny? Uh, that's, that's, that's it, man. All that's, right, it was pretty it. good. 
All right, so she is running. Are you doing okay with those temporary hit points I gave you, or are you still kind of? No, I, I haven't been hit. Like I'm, right. I'm good. I'm at like twenty nine or something. All right, so Ilmar sees Kenjamin and what he's doing and looks back. He, he goes to back up into the shade underneath the lip of the roof here uh, and then goes and shuts the door right there. I got you, buddy. Oh, hey, thanks, man. Uh, oh, and well, then he's... <laughs> I'm not supposed to get it anymore. <laughs> um, hmm. I guess that gargoyle right there. He's gonna. Ugh. Come at me? No, he uh, Ilmar. Ilmar. No, this Ilmar guy. is looking at what to do. I guess he just does a normal oh. attack on the gargoyle and chops off one of its arms. Dust sprays. Oh. <clears throat> just a little bit. Okay. Who's that? Here, let me make them visible in the order. You as well. All right, so this staff member um, does a wisdom save. All right. And fails. Give me that damage. He does yeah. not like what's happening, so he, All right. he leaves. He but Randy, Randy could take a opportunity attack. Well, I guess it doesn't matter. Sorry, he actually dies from the spirit guardians before. Like he goes to leave, and the spirit guardians just hit him in the head. <laughs> he hits him with a monkey wrench upside the head. Hey, where you think you're going, eh? That's what you get for coming on the construction site, son. <laughs> hey, you're not wearing a hard hat. What's going on? <laughs> Watch out for you. falling beams. <laughs> oh, all right, great. Uh, now this person, uh, I guess, runs up towards Nencho, who's attacking Saya. Does she technically enter the spirit guardian? Ah, uh, no. Ah, uh. unfortunately. All right, so just goes to claw at you like crazy. Double claws. First one comes down, she misses. She comes down with her other one. Gets you in the cheek for four slashing damage. This freaks you out a little bit. Yeah, but you Whoa. succeed and you're not frightened of this woman. Is she a woman? Who even knows? All right, you don't she's... scare me, Scarecrow. <laughs> a Xerox. You're in the middle of the spirit guardians. What are you doing? Um, can I send uh, some dissonant whispers over this gar uh, gargoyle? Yeah, if you want. Now, okay, so yeah. t just an added thing of dissonant whispers is it's going to run away from you. So if like if there's a place you want it to go, you could place yourself there and make it run away. I'm pretty sure I'm thinking of that right. That's dissonant whispers, right? Dissonant whispers. Um, yeah. Well, I think it is that one if just it do fails, second damage? It or? has to move away from you. So yeah, you could definitely do the damage. It's just, it's gonna move away. So like, you could technically aim yourself so that it ran past your allies. So they got opportunity attacks or I don't know, just you can Ooh, that'd be good. plan yeah, so where he's going. Yeah, so maybe up here over by uh, Nensho. Okay, so I guess Over place yourself direction. so that the opposite direction will lead him that direction. Say, hey, I don't know. Well, there, who, who are you attacking? Gargoyle? Is it, the, is gargoyle. the gargoyle is right there, um, so be tough. He, he's kind of standing where you want him to be, you know? Yeah. If I use it. You could. You could do it on this dude, and because he's holding uh, our guy right now, and that would help. Like maybe he would drop him. Oh, we have to. You can only use it on creatures, right? Anything oh, yeah, is technically a creature. Oh, yeah. okay, got it. Okay. 
Yeah, might as well do it on that dude then. Okay, so move yourself so that he moves opposite of you in the direction you want him to go. So like if you were like somewhere like right there. All right, cool. Cool, like we like we like lock eyes, and all of a sudden, here's this sound. What's the? Chabber, 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 Yeah, yeah. Well, oh, sorry. Hit the damage, and then it'll it'll do the stuff. It's like uh, really. So yeah, you, you like uh, hum cool. this fucked up ditty to towards him. Uh, he succeeds, so he takes half the damage. It just means he doesn't move away, I believe. Yeah. Yeah. He's got to be close to going down, man. He's been, I know he's been taking reduced damage, but still, damn. All right. So awesome. Yeah, you did that. Uh, I think you're out of the Bardic Inspirations. Um, do you move anywhere else? Uh, no, I'm good here, actually. All right. Sounds good. I know. Yeah, you're safe in the Spirit Guardian area. Um, all right. Who that? Oh, she's dead. Let's get her. Let's mark her defeated. All right. Gargi is in the area. Let's give him a whiz. Denied. Okay. Denied. Uh, give me that damage, Kevbo. damage hell yes all right it's his turn Govna, and he swoops in at you uh and goes to bite you get it and misses he goes to claw at you i think he gets you oh ah holy shit he's just going nuts he gets you for seven slashing damage give me that constitution save i think it's oh, First he would, up. first he would uh, take the damage from the the, uh, the spirit guardians, right? Yeah, yeah he did. Okay, he did. good, good, cool. Zablau. Do you have, you have disadvantage? Yeah, I'm gonna lie, but it wouldn't matter um, anyway. He technically wouldn't be, he, or if he's still frightened, he would be, uh, even though he can't well, see no, he her. I'm not sure. No, I think it's only if he can see her. So but it doesn't matter. You got an eight and a five. So yeah, it was a, it was a. Fair, it's an eight, uh, like eight plus three. Uh, it's an eleven. Oh, I see. An eleven. Um, I don't think that does it. Did he do more it's than twenty damage? damage? Yeah, it would be ten unless he did like more than. Oh 20 yeah, that's damage. the Constitution save. So yeah, sorry. Yeah, eleven would totally do it. So you're still focusing on your thing. Perfect. Zoop, zoop, zap, zap. And you're right. Uh, he has. You, she bugs? has to be with like within the uh, line of sight for the frighten to be working. Oh, yeah. Smart. Yeah. All right. So the the gargoyle swooped in, did it shit. Um, I don't think it's. Gonna... I'm not gonna let you get rid of the this, the spirit guardians that easy. Um, uh, and it <laughs> it just swoops around you so that I can get out of the fucking spirit gardens area. Um, greeny, green lady. All right. Um, what has she got left? She's... <coughs> oh, she knows what she wants. Um, she, she just looks... Oh, let me see where everybody is. Hmm. I guess she just goes to aim at Kenjamin and casts first level spell. Uh, a surge of energy shoots out towards you, but just slams into the ground, totally missing. Uh, and then she just heads off towards the edge of the building there. This staff members inside. No, he's dead. Get him out of the list. Wow. Falthrax is grappled by Sayeth. Uh, he tries to break free. Let's see here.
Does he get free? He does. He kicks the guy in the shin again. He disengages and he books it, uh, I guess, this way up towards the door here. Um, oh, wait. Does he have the movement? Yeah, he does. Okay, he goes inside. He slams the door behind him. Oh. Well, no, yeah, because he couldn't help. All right. <coughs> Where are we at? This. Where is this? At? Oh, in the doorway. She's inside. Yeah. Um. Okay. So she down there. I guess she's just attacking the door. All right. Hang on. How am I gonna do this? So you just hear claws scratching the door. Scratch, scratch, scratch. Um, and Wood Ilmar, has an AC of 15. Ilmar is it, just like holding it there, yeah. It looks like it would have like 10 HP. Or no, 18 HP. Was that just a typical door? I looked up inanimate objects, and wood and bone has the AC of 15, and then <laughs> a medium-sized object has, uh, well, well, if it's fragile, it has 4 uh, HP, and if it's resilient, it has 18 HP, so it's up to you. Well, I'm going to double check, because some, sometimes specific places specify. Oh, uh, that's true. Claws, uh, claws, uh, so this gargoyle, gargoyle to the north, claws at... Uh, Sirena. Did I do it right? And tries to bite her. It is Morty's turn. He is no longer incapacitated. Um, uh, do, do, do. What's his speed? So uh, I guess Morty sees his mom taking off around the side of the building and just like books it through the spirit guardian field uh, <laughs> and towards towards her. Uh, he's got to do his save. Did does he? Uh, did you count the slowing effect whenever he runs through there? Or he loses half his speed whenever he Ooh. enters the spirit guardian uh, too. I think it doesn't matter, but yeah, that's a good point too. Or I think. We'll double check. He would lose half his total speed, so he yeah. would like move normally until he got into it, and then. Or what I have to use the restroom. I will be right back. Alrighty. Apply that damage. He ran to his mommy. Let me double check where. Yeah, because he dashed anyway, so yeah, he can totally make it there. Alrighty, where are we at? Sayeth is there. Um, the other dude ran away, you're in his face, so he actually moves up here so he can be flanking. Got it. It's okay, I've got two axes. And... This is probably gonna hurt. He just he he had seen you with your fire breath and goes it goes at you with just a, a ray of fire it probably comes out of his mouth, uh, hits you for eight fire damage and then goes again with another one. A I get two and a four. Fuck you, guy. All right, cool. So he's just there attacking you, Serena. Uh, I guess it's just get going one on one with this gargoyle. Goes to. 
touch it. I need her to attack this guy. Pardon me. All right, Nencho, what are you doing? All right. I'm going to move right here. <clears throat> okay. Then I guess we're just going to try to take it on Sayeth. I feel like he's a bigger target than or bigger threat than this other woman. Yeah. Battle axe for a question. That's a hit. Hell yeah. Slams into him with your battle axe. Um, uh, we'll do it again. Nice. Ooh, yeah. Hit after hit. Nash so up. low. Uh, <clears throat> Chipping away then, at him. Is he still, he's still moving? Still moving. All right. All right. One more with uh, my uh, bonus attack. 19 is just enough. Mm -hmm. This is only going to do 8 damage. It's not going to do the plus 3 because... Uh, oh, it's your offhand it, it, or whatever? Yeah, it's my offhand. Okay. Alrighty. And, yeah, I think that's it. And that's your turn. Alright, so you're just swinging. You go back to back with Xerox. You're swinging at Saith on the outside of the Spirit Guardian Circle. Kenjamin. What are you doing? All right. This gargoyle oh, has what? swooped around at you. Dano. You? Uh, how low are you on health? I'm very low. I'm not looking too good. All right. So what I'm going to do is I am going to cast bloop, beep, boop, bop, that right there. All right. Uh, where is it? I know it's only healing word, but I'm casting it at third level. I'll Damn. take every healing word you ever give me. <laughs> All right. Oh, I didn't want to do that. I think I rolled initiative again on accident. I don't know. <laughs> All right. Boom. Yes. Oh, my God. Ugh. <laughs> oh, wait. <laughs> Hang on. Wait. Oh, my God. I, I don't have him selected, though. I tried to unselect him, which is weird. I think you have Sayeth targeted. So anyway, uh -oh. let's let's just. I didn't. No, click I tried him. to make sure. I so that was a bonus action. Can there I cast a cantrip too? Uh, healing word is a cantrip, and that was healing a bonus action. A, healing words, uh, first level spell. spell. Yeah. Oh. I okay. Well then, yeah, yeah, you can do a cantrip. I knew healing word was one of those. Yeah. You can't do two spells, but you can do like a cantrip and a spell? Yeah. I okay. So. Alright. Well, I was I was hoping for that, because then I'm going to use where is that? Spells. Where are you at? Check your dick. Uh, there it is. Yeah. Give me that damage. God damn it. <laughs> Alright, wisdom save from Sayeth. He succeeds. I tried. You right. did try. I'm out of spells except for cantrips. All right. Is that your turn? That is my turn. All right. Oh, my God. That 18 HP was so fucking clutch, dude. You have no idea. Or I'm happy I could help. That was my that was my last spell, too. So it I figured so, I had to use it on someone. So, so useful. I was just like, hey. Tell them that you just walk in there. You're like, yeah, that's what I will tell them. <laughs> um, I guess Ilmar goes around the outside and attacks the woman here with his... Oh, damn it. Well, no. I guess he goes to here, still in the shadows, and shoots with his hand crossbow. It shoots... He has a crossbow that shoots hands? Yeah, it's and it, it grows to grab her in the face. What? That's awesome. What? Oh, okay. I, that's weird. All right. 
staff member is dead. Mark him down. Match it. This staff member uh, runs in at Ilmar, pissed that he's attacking her. I thought I we would worked like together. I would like to use my uh, reaction to attack her. All right, for sure. Eighteen enough. Eighteen does it. Oh. Let me apply that. Let me apply that. Uh, what was she concentrating on? Oh, no, he doesn't have a concentration mark. Okay, cool. Uh, so you attack, you hit. She has two claw attacks. She did one, it hits. Second one also hits him. And he fails, and he just, like, is scared. He's backed up against the wall. He can barely move. That's his turn. Xerox, you're up. <clears throat> uh, can you low on health? I am at 29. If I had to say a number out loud, you know. <laughs> on, a scale of, on a scale of 45 to 0, I'm about a 29. <laughs> All right. <laughs> Is there anything I can do to help We you need learn? to take this guy out. Uh, oh, you okay, are please. a bard, right? You might have some spells, but if not... Oh, uh... I. I'd focus, yeah, I'd focus on that yeah, guy. Let's, uh, let's take out this dude. If you have, like, a spell, I'd, I'd throw it at him. You can mock him, maybe, or something. Let's, ah, shit, I don't really have anything I can, except for maybe if I use Hideous Laughter again. Good work. You can, oh, you, can yeah. it, you can cast it at a higher level, too. I don't know what kind of spell slash you have right now, but... I think that's one of the ones you can cast at a higher level, which if it, like it's, it'll be a hard to resist. I can cast it at third level. Like that? Uh, I, mean, I don't. Yeah. Well, hang on. I'm looking at it, and it, the description Does doesn't it? mention it being better at higher levels. Oh, it doesn't scale. No. Yeah, and I don't think the DC scales either with the level of the spell cast. Does yeah. it? I don't. That's just to say, you could use Hideous Laughter, just use a level one so you can keep oh, yeah. your higher level. Basically, I look over, that. I'm like, hey, your mom was so fat, and then I hit. <laughs> oh, then... shit. <laughs> you, you're planning to make him laugh based on his mom being so fat. Uh, yeah. Wonderful. Yeah, all right. Uh, well, he succeeds his, unfortunately, he just is not, he doesn't have a good sense of humor, so nothing <laughs> is triggering his laughter. Not a good sense of humor. Damn, I'm not. <laughs> Dead crowd tonight. Yeah, it's yeah, <laughs> tough crowd. You'll be here all night. Okay, well, shoot. Do you move anywhere? Uh... Nah, I'm going to stay with that. Okay. Dang, that's. I'm sorry, man. <laughs> You're trying. I, I get it. <laughs> all right, this Gargi. I'm also kind of getting log jammed. This Gargi's gonna jam your log hard. Oh, you bet, you better not. You better not. He That's jams not. it. Oh Consider this God. log jam. Consider that log the jam. jam. Pump it up. He goes to claw you again after that, but misses. Is he gonna claw my jam too? He's gonna claw it. He's doing whatever he can to your jam. Jeez. You're gonna smear it on toast. What? Oh yeah, I know. It's weird. All right. Um, what's your distance to anything? Great. That's wonderful. All right. So uh, from right around the corner, please work. Green Song, like, gets Kenjamin in her sight and starts reciting uh, uh, the words to another spell that I really hope works. Oh, I, I got to roll concentration for that last one. I'm sorry. I rolled an eight again, but you know. You rolled an eight? Yeah. Oh, well, that's for your yeah. your fail. For I the, think he for needs the, yeah, to take out the threatened. <laughs> the other one would technically be at 16. 
Okay, so what is for what? Oh, well, I'm going to so, take the eight for the polymorph attack that just happened because that's what yeah. it registered as. And then... Oh, well, the wisdom saving throw... Well, so that first one was for me to maintain my spirit guardians. And then the second one I rolled was my wisdom saving throw, which was a 10. So it was Plus a 16. Six. So both succeeded. I maintained my Whoa. concentration. Because well, I rolled an look, 8. The, the polymorph prompted for a specific one. And that one yeah, that rolled was an 8. Throw. That was the... No, well, no, because he rolled with disadvantage, my first one, which he I, technically doesn't have right now. So it was a little bit confusing. He still has the frightened effect on him, for one. Right? Well, so the first hit, one was a constitution saving throw. And he hit the prompt for I wouldn't for have my bonus modifier. And then my second one was my wisdom saving throw. For the polymorph because the first one cool. would just be I, I don't have my wisdom that would be a constitution saving throw he, he was late on doing the constitution from last turn whenever he got hit by yeah. the gargoyle right i i don't know if i understand what you guys are saying but like okay so when, rolled, when the polymorph attacked my... when the polymorph uh, when the attack just happened at him it asked him for a roll and he clicked a button yeah, to do yeah. that and that one but i had another one up so i didn't roll my constitution saving throw for my concentration so when okay. you rolled and told me to roll the first thing i clicked was the constitution saving throw and then and i clicked again and then it was the wisdom saving throw then what we were saying for the eight on the on the wisdom when he he did click that but he shouldn't have disadvantage right now so that he I'm not rolled in the a on the actual one unless you're saying you're just going to take the first roll that went since uh he shouldn't have had disadvantage because he still got the frightened effect on him, even though he can't see the lady. So it's like mm. automatically rolling the disadvantage. So when you right. click the prompts, that's why it showed up as an 8, but it should be a 16. Where is the 6? Okay, I get it. Because it gave him disadvantage, unless you want him to re-roll yeah, it. Or, I mean, you could take it that too, but that's just where we're coming from. I hear you. Yeah. Because I rolled twice, because I had to click twice to roll my wisdom saving throw. Okay, well, I don't see a concentration check at all, Go so I'm just twice. confused about what is... I so, guess I see it above I the polymorph. Okay. Yeah. Okay. Um, yeah, sorry, not trying to... <laughs> yeah, well, like it's just so much of this is automated, and so, like, now I'm just looking at how I'm, uh, I'm supposed to, like, look at what role is actually supposed to be for what. Um, sure. Okay, so your constitution saving throw is failed. Was so eight. you're, so I'm you're just not, I'm technically frightened because yeah, I. Does he, does he still have the disadvantage? Because it's automatically when they rolling the disadvantage for him every time too. So that's like another thing that we were, uh, like, you know, that's right. why we're saying the numbers don't like. No, I get like, it. No, I get it. Yeah, for sure. Yeah, I know yeah. it's not adding up. I'm yeah, just. Like, so, I mean, I'm not yeah. right now, but I guess if she comes through the door, you'll have to add the condition again. Well, let's, yeah, well, technically, you can, uh, let's say that you guys are, will be in charge of adding these, because you can just add them from the condi conditions okay. tab easily, okay. so, like, yeah. Cool. Um, okay. But, no, no, you're right. That was that was adding some, some weird stuff to the rules. Yeah, I'm sorry. Um, no, don't be sorry. It's all good. We got it figured out. Okay, so, it, um... Look, I was just pumped that you failed it, and uh, now we gotta refigure it out. Right, so, I mean, you can just re-roll me. Take it. We can take the roll. We could re-roll or whatever. I, it's fine. You could just polymorph me. Yeah, I don't know. I mean, I don't want to force it, but I almost. I, and it's not your fault with the buttons. Technically, I will say that if if you guys forget to un. No, that's not fair. Whatever. Uh, we'll figure Look, it. Look, we we can do it from this point forward. If there's conditions fucked up and the dice hit the table, that's just is, is what it is. Yeah, yeah. I mean, I don't want to like make it shitty, but just no, just to keep things sure. going forward, you know. Absolutely. Um, okay. Absolutely. Yeah, yeah. So, you know what? Uh, yeah, we're just to keep it going. We're gonna we're gonna say that you got polymorphed, buddy, and then so you you failed your concentration check as well, and you lost the spirit guardians, and all right. What would have your second wisdom saving throw have been? It would have 16. been a 16. Where are you seeing the 16? So I clicked the 2d20 thing and it popped it down. 
So the so, first one was a two and a ten. So if I guess, he wouldn't I guess, have rolled disadvantage, like well, his other guy, the first roll would have been a two anyway. Okay. Yeah, I guess you're right. Right. Okay. Well, anyway, so yeah, you're unfortunately you are you you feel yourself change form, uh, and uh, we're gonna have to call you. Uh, um. I'm trying, I'm trying to think, trying of, to think of a fly, like brundle fly term, because you change into a giant fly. I'm thinking of the, the movie with Jeff Goldblum. Buzz the Jimin. fly. All right, Kenjimin. Kenjimin chains form <laughs> into this gigantic fly that's on the, the battlefield now. Uh, perfect. Aren't you excited? Kind of. It's just been a long battle. <laughs> yeah, I know. I know. It sure has. A gigantic fly. Just fly over there and fuck him up. <laughs> oh, finally open the door. Well... No, she was... Yeah, I mean, she's there, unfortunately. Yeah, she opens the door, comes out, turns over, goes at Ilmar. Poor Ilmar. Claw attack, claw attack. First one misses, second one hits. Six slashing. He is scared of both of these people. Uh, Gargoyle. He's down, actually. Oh yeah, he's unconscious. He's so scared, he fainted. <laughs> uh, where are we at? This person's still coming at Sirena. Bite. Claw. Misses, misses. Morty's turn. He's chilling over there. He's, he's fine. All right. Um, I can bare my teeth and say it. Ooh, he's not having it. Um, I guess he steps over here because the the spirit guardians are gone, and he goes to fire ray you, Nencho, and then he right. turns and he just kind of carries it over towards Xerox. He misses you, Nencho, but hits Xerox for ooh thirteen. Fire damage Jeez. burning you up. Holy crap, Xerox. Sirena. Check. What, Xerox? Check concentration check. Are you concentrating on anything right no, now? I don't, I don't maybe, maybe it's like leftovers from Hideous Laughter or something. But yeah, oh, I, that, really oh, I think that is it. I think it put it there. Let's just take it off. Can I Can I call out to Sirena? Sirena, my blades don't do much against him. Attack him, please. Okay. Uh, cool. So she comes in. She swoops over to him. And. Like, just stares him in the eyes. And then, like, just kind of points behind him. Okay, hang on. Is he supposed to be saving? Hang on, let me try this again. All right, great. Uh, and you, yeah, I guess you just see him turn around and just like, ah! He just gasps out of nowhere. <laughs> awesome, Nencho, what are you doing? All right, uh, I'm gonna take a swing at this guy. Yes, yes! Hell yes, ooh! Now that's a chunk of damage right there. 
Alright, I know it's reduced, but come on, another one. Uh, not, not enough. Mm, you missed that one. You're swinging at him. You get one good attack. Uh, bonus action, attack again. Nope. Mm, misses. Oh well. And then... Let's see, can I see this magical effect over here? No. I can't. So, can I... Assume that's safe if I walk up. Okay. Uh, damn it, I should have fucking. If I would have known that, I would have tried to get advantage, but oh well. Uh, you will, you right. can do that. You want to do that? Just do another attack. That's fine. At least one. Yeah, you see nothing behind him. No, but that no unfortunately, that misses. Okay. Alright, that'll be my turn. Alrighty. Kenjamin. Uh huh. I don't know. What do I do? <laughs> so oh yeah, that's that's true. See, the thing is, is uh, you find yourself a giant fly, and uh, it's actually the only beast that doesn't have any attack actions, but has a high amount of HP. So you're stuck. This fly, you can oh fly around God, if you want. That's so stupid. I hate that. That sounds dumb. <laughs> uh, <laughs> Flies are dumb. <laughs> I mean, do I even think, or am I just polymorphed? Like, I, I'm just a fly. Do I even you, control myself? I think you, you can your control stats. yourself. But, like, you, if you, you have to you, make rolls, you go off of the fly's stuff. Yeah, so, you keep your mental stats, I'm pretty sure, but your physical and everything else is changed to whatever that is. So it's a large thing. You could probably, like, fly in front of people to give them cover or something uh, like it that. It looks like uh, the target's game statistics including mental ability scores are replaced by the statistic of the chosen oh. beast. Mm -hmm. oh, nothing. I fly around. Oh, he can't like distract enemies or anything. No, you, you don't lose your like consciousness, but like you might be you might be doing a little bit dumber or something. <laughs> yeah, I mean if you if you are playing the fly as just flying fly. around wherever, then that's how that's cool. Yeah. Yep. All right. <laughs> Sorry. It's alright. You're like, oh, this battle's going on forever, and now I can't do anything about it. <laughs> oh, yeah, that's frustrating. Sorry about that. Your DM's a dick. Uh, Ilmar's okay, passed out. <laughs> this staff member is just kicking him while he's down. It's just uh, swinging on him from above with a claw attack. That's an immediate... Critical. It's a medical critical. Yeah, literally, yeah, it says oh, I'm man. limited. I'm limited in the actions I can perform by the nature of my new form. I can't mm -hmm. speak, can't or take any other action that requires hands or speech. Yeah, but you can still think. I mean, but it's I can't use hands. Yeah. Or cast spells. You or could, you could, uh, give uh, attacks of opportunity. Like you could flank people. I'm pretty sure. I could, I think that's uh, and like block their area. That's probably true. Or you could probably take the help action like a familiar could or something like that. Like distracting somebody. Yeah. Well, Xerox, you're up. Yep. Let's see what you yeah. can do. So I see Nencho basically trying to and struggling to, to hit this dude, so... Well, I'm you see him turn into a giant bug, but yeah, you can attack the dude. No, this guy. Uh, oh, Nencho. My bad. Yeah. I'm sorry. Yeah, yeah. you're absolutely yeah. right. I was like gonna take out my long sword and, and take a whack at him. Okay, whack this dude. Whack him off. <laughs> Get him off. Shoot. Uh, well. Uh. Damn it, Kevin! You got <laughs> fucking not uh doing too good. Bardic inspiration still. Did that do anything? Oh, I, I. Yeah, he still does have that. He. Uh, oh. Yeah, I guess they could be utilizing that. Um. Did that do anything, bro? You know no, what? No, just just for the sake missed. of you having some fun here, I'll say that you're technically, you get advantage because a number of alloys are around. You're not technically flanking, but you've missed so many times. Just attack again. I just want to see. Here we go. Okay. I'll, nice. I'll give it to you. Fuck yeah. All right. So cl click your critical fast. Yeah. Fuck yeah, you do good. It doesn't kill him, but you slice him yeah. down the chest. This guy has to be so close. Yeah, no shit. Gar Gargi. All right, 
Gargi uh, goes to attack the giant fly, which is technically good, but... All right, giant fly, Flush. you take some damage. Uh, green sun. And she's just laughing. She thinks it's hilarious. Um, and now that you're giant fly, she, I guess, moves in a little bit more so she can see more people. Oh, it has to be one person. Okay, what's the distance? Uh, I guess she comes all the way up to here and gets Xerox in her sights. And then I guess she just shouts out to you like, Oh, you think those those tricks are funny? Uh, I'll show you something that's funny. I'll give you something to laugh about, buddy. And you just get this uncontrollable urge to start dancing just in place. Oh, and you fail. Oh, so you no. just start uh. dancing just like <laughs> with a cane just in place. You must use all of your movement to dance without leaving its space, and you have disadvantage on dexterity saving throws and attack rolls. Oh no. <laughs> oh, that's awesome. It's alright because I'm dancing though, so. This is how you guys die. Alright, he's chilling in here. What are we looking at? This staff member turns around. Um, I mean, it's not in their best. Yeah. You know what? They're just, they're scared of this fly. They don't know any better. So they go to claw this fucking fly. Critical hit. You're getting beat up, buddy. Aw, shucks. Uh, yeah, and the, 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 the insides of the, the bug start to ooze out. It's shell goes in for another claw attack on you. It's good though, because if they kill the fly, you just turn back into you. Yeah. It's true. Alright, staff's beating you up. This Gargi's turning down towards. Oh, I guess it flies over here, and it's getting advantage on Serena. There's a bite. Claw. All right. What's Morty doing? Oh, Morty follows. Okay. All right. Great. Um. Say if. Oh, um. Oh, yeah, he's, well, I guess he's going to go for her because he's flanking. I guess he just grabs his... No, he just fire rays it. A critical hit on Sirena. No. Oh, no. Oh, damn it. She is not unconscious. And then he turns around to you. And does a fire ray. Normal, doesn't have advantage. Ooh, hits you with a 26. Alrighty. 15 damage there. Man, these guys are strong. Nencho, what are you doing? He is hanging oh. in there, but weak. Gonna try. Hopefully we can get a hit. Do I have anything? Gotta go for it. Nancho. Oh. All right. First one misses. Second one hits. Come on, oh, yeah. damage! Damn it! Ooh. It's like so close. You almost hear a voice. Finish him. 
bonus attack. Come on. Damn it. All right. Oh, you miss. That's turn. Um, I'm going to. Oh, damn it. I did it again. I could have got advantage. Uh, that's it. With oh, if you went up. I'll give you. I'll give you a reroll on at least one of them if you want. All right. Let's see. Get a critical like Randy got. That's a hit at least. Hell yeah. That does it. If you want to describe it, what, is, what happens? You get um, the perfect position. Foster. I'm just having a hard time because this guy, it seems like my attacks aren't doing as much damage and I'm just like, just go down. And I finally get him right in the collarbone. Ooh, yeah. hell yeah. Nice. It's fine. All right. All right. And then I want to spend the remainder of my movement moving here. So technically oh, moving through their bodies will, yeah, if you can go around then. Well, let's see. And then I would only be able to get here. I figured since he was down, I could go over him, but yeah. That's, well, that's, you can go over him. It's just rough terrain. Oh, okay. All right, then uh, think. Yeah, I think that's where I'm gonna be. Okay. Hell yeah. Okay. Uh, is there some sort of? I don't know if there is. Give me a wisdom save, Benjamin. I am right now. Sorry. It's all good. <laughs> Four. <laughs> Jeez. All right. Unfortunately, you're a giant fly still. Word. I'm Word. doing the fly stuff. Just hell yeah, fly stuff. Puking up stuff on the things you want to eat. <laughs> yeah. Yeah, yeah. Dope stuff like that. All right. Uh, Ilmar is dead. All right. Jesus. This staff member runs up towards Xerox. No, runs towards the fly. I don't, we're getting you out of this, whether this is a meta or not. She, this giant fly is new to her. She's just freaking out. Get this thing out of here. Uh, but misses both of those attacks. All right, Xerox, oh, what are you God. doing? Yeah, so I'm going to land a giant stink bomb here. I have a uh, stinking cloud. Okay. Oh, like right here. If you could get all three of those guys right there, these are the like threats. There's two of them right here also, but I can just target that. I don't have to like move over there. I can just target that area, right? I think uh, so. Assuming. What's the range on the spell? Let's see. It's, I think it's ten. No, twenty foot radius. Ninety feet is the range. So yeah, you, yeah, could, you can hit anything. You can you hit anything. Any of these guys. I right, so yeah. I'm basically gonna like see here. So if I. I need to place that, or I just hit cast spell, and then it'll let me place it. Uh, it, yeah, cast spell, and then it'll ask you some stuff and talk oh, about cool. a place measured. Yeah. Is this good? All right. Oh my lordy! All right. Green song <laughs> fails. She starts gasping in this cloud of of noxious gas uh that you hear the dog like <coughs> uh the, the yeah the one he's unconscious and he's dead but he's puking up uh kenjamin oh kenjamin's there but you're not you you're the fly the fly fails uh and the the no the fly succeeds great what happens to these things constitution save against poison on a failed save the creature spends its action that turn retching and reeling creatures that don't need to breathe or are immune to poison automatically succeed on the same throw okay so everyone just spends the next turn puking this next this next turn that's great Jokes on you i'm already doing that on my food <laughs> yeah, exactly you got ahead of the curve uh that's right. this this gargoyle Spends its turn puking. Green song is retching in this. Uh, 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 
Uh, you gave them a taste of their own medicine, essentially. Uh, Falthrax is up there. He's whatever. You know what? He busts out through the door. Uh, and doesn't really see what he can do. Has he got any weapons? He does, but it's only a boss. Okay, cool. That's that. The staff member is attacking this fly. Oh, yeah. Oh, critical hit. You hit me, baby. Oh, yeah. Beat oh. me up. Oh, snap. <laughs> You're just getting scritches, essentially. They're just oh. pounding on ya. Yeah. Okay, four slashing damage, two to remaining. Okay, so uh, you you warp back into Kenjamin Healy form, uh, but uh, two of the remaining damage comes in, knocking you down to 17, but you are you again, you feel good. Well, I got temporary HP. I should have, I think, well, do I still have temp HP? I don't know if that works. I don't know how that works, but I don't know. I why think I'm it was already it. taken oh, away. I don't see any left in the temp. I think yeah. it was subtracted from other attacks. Oh, okay, okay. Uh, okay, so it's this Gargi. Well, who's that? That Gargoyle's turn. Okay, comes down. Or, well, probably doesn't even come down. Uh, just is sitting there on top of Greensong's body or Margana's body and goes to bite at Xerox and misses and goes to claw as well and hits ya for three slashing but it doesn't kill ya Morty okay, I'm concentrating though so I can either roll a concentration right what do you con oh you're concentrating on yeah, the, the cloud. fog cloud yes okay so you fail your concentration and the fog cloud goes away. And you do that, then it's Morty's turn. Uh, so it's not, I guess he doesn't have to deal with the shit anymore. He is poisoned, but uh, I guess Morty runs up to Nencho and just goes and blast fire out of his oh, doggy no. mouth. Wow. <laughs> that Nencho and a couple of different people get hit. Might be the end of old Nencho. It doesn't look too good for me. Ooh. Did you both go down? Oh my yep. lord. All right. Oh. That's a good doggy. All right. <laughs> uh, Sayeth, what he do? Um, he did. <laughs> oh yeah, he did. Get him out of this. My dead bodies out there. All right, Nencho, death save. Yep. You guys got this. Oh no! Womp. At least it's not a one. At, At least, least it's, it's not, not a one. A one. Kenjamin, you've woken uh, up. Your friends are unconscious. What are you doing? I have no spells. Oh, no. You know, spare the dying? Nope. All right. Well, I would say use your death. Uh, what's the grave? The... That's the one that does two, yeah, death toll. I think that's probably... Toll the dead. I don't know. Probably. Um... Fifteen foot cube. All right, I'm gonna use this. Uh... All right. Oh, it's an AOE for a cancer? That's good. Ooh, what did you do? On a con you got to succeed on a con saving throw or take 1d6. Okay, click the damage on that. 
Actually, it's 2d6 since you're 5th level, too. Boom! Well, it's making me do it, but... That's fine. I'm not, you know. I mean, I won't apply any of the damage. Yeah. That's fine. For him, but now I'm not getting. Oh, it's Final each creature. Thing. There we go. Oh, because it was just waiting for you. Okay, uh, cool. Okay. So, um, yeah, Morty takes a chunk of damage. Uh, that woman takes oh. a chunk of damage. That gargoyle, no, she does, and then don't apply it to you. All oh, right, fuck yeah. And what what is this? This is just like a bunch of energy surging around the field word of radiance i think i just say something i do, i just say a word i say new york style pizza and then new york a burning style radiance pizza. 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 A burning pizza. radiance erupts from me <laughs> all right is that your whole turn yeah all right that's all i got man pretty sure it's just an action so yep okay cool cool This staff member. Um, you gotta do it, man. You gotta do it. It is what it is. In. Do it. Comes in to go at you. You're the only one left. Let's do it. Do well, it. It should have been with advantage too. Do it. Todd's gonna. Okay, end. so that's the first one. This is the second attack. Ooh, a crit. Oh my goodness, yep. <laughs> there we go. That's probably... That doesn't do him in. That's her turn. All right. Uh, Xerox, death saving throw. Roll a 20. Roll a 20? Yeah, just yeah, roll a 20. Uh, so uh, you'll go to utility, I think, and then death save. Ugh. Not a 20, but uh, it's still a, a pass, so that's good. All right, this Gargi. Oh, I should have done advantage. Whatever, it hits you. And goes in for the second claw attack. I don't know why I'm really good. Misses. All right. Here, I'll take it off. I don't... It... There we go. All right. Greens. That's on. hilarious. I didn't what? realize that it was... A, the. I didn't realize that concentrating was like a brain, like with like a, like a reloading, oh, yeah. refreshing kind of... <laughs> uh -huh, I thought it was yeah. like... I thought it was this. I thought it was... Somebody mm -hmm. like, like holding up little tiny fingers like... <laughs> Right. Uh, she vanishes. Falthrax runs runs into the battlefield, uh, and uh, hmm. I guess medicine checks Nencho. Six. Unfortunately, you're not stabilized. Who's next? Oh. Oh, what's what's this? You guys notice something weird. Um, no. Oh, it's a okay. terrace? Shit! <laughs> yeah, right. Tut. Uh, hey, hey, have you guys uh, seen any of my uh, pony uh, pictures, you guys? Spibby steps out from around to the side of the building and blasts a, uh, where is it? Where's this Eldritch Blast? Blast an Eldritch Blast at one of these ladies standing there around Kenjamin. No way! Critical hit! All right, Spibby's in it. 
Ow! Just oh, oh. straw goes everywhere. <clears throat> um, and then, you know what? He also casts his bonus action to... Where is it? There it is. Maybe. This tentacle pops up over here and does some sort of an attack. Doing it? No. Let's just do this. Okay, yeah, that hits. So that person takes four full damage. Great. Uh, right. Steph, which Steph member? That Steph member's there. She, I guess she steps up. And yeah, she's gonna attack Falthrax with a claw attack and then also attack the tentacle. But she misses, no, she hits Falthrax. Sorry, Falthrax. All right, and then just she just swipes through the tentacle like it doesn't exist. I think that's how that works. Um, this gargoyle swoops in on Falthrax as well. Bite. Claw. Misses. All right, Morty, 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 Morty. All right, so I guess he jumps down towards <laughs> Benjamin and just goes to bite you. Oh, I don't know why it was with disadvantage. What was the other roll? He's poisoned. First one was five anyway. Perfect. He misses. All right, we're he's back poisoned. at Nen Show. Huh? Oh, that is why. Okay. Well then, perfect. Nensho, death save. All right, one good one. One good one for you, Kenjamin Healy's. You're surrounded, but Spibby is yeah, showing up. You might have a chance. Do the same thing. Uh, oh, click the slip stuff or whatever. Yeah, here, I'll, uh, not you, not you, not you, not me. All right. Oh, that's funny. I don't think it matters. I think it's just whatever's inside of there. Oh, uh, okay. Thanks for trying, but I'll just not yeah, click try. the ones that don't matter. I'm trying to make that thing go away, the template, but, you know. Oh, if you click down to the template range, or, or like right under the player control is the little uh, L shape, and that'll let you oh, okay. affect it. I deleted them, though. All right, so we got a bunch of people that took a bunch of damage. Morty takes a chunk of damage. That staff member takes some damage. Falthrax, no, that staff member, and all right, awesome. You have hurt a bunch of people. What else are you do? What can he? Uh, that's it. That's all I got. All right. All right. Who it is? All right, this person is just. Uh, well, you know what? I'm just gonna see. Okay, uh, just thinks she's gonna swing at the tentacle for the first attack here. And she misses and just is like, fuck that. And then comes in with the second attack at Kenjamin, clawing at you. 10 misses. Xerox, another death saving throw. Right up. Nice. Okay, that's another good one. 
Gargoyle. Alright, coming in at Kenjamin with some attacks. It hits. This could be it for you. Probably. It is. It's it for you. You go on. <laughs> uh, okay. I'm walking. Yeah. <laughs> songs out of there. I'm dying. Yeah. <laughs> <You're> dying <here. laughs> Foul Thrax. Um. Shit. Um. Fuck. What is he gonna do? I guess he just goes to a attack the person no he goes to attack the gargoyle above him okay he knocks a chunk out of the gargoyle uh, I guess he's gonna stay there and see if he can help some people Spibby for Ooh, okay what is... can Spibby raise anybody up let's see what he's got um no, of course he doesn't. I assume he's got mostly offensive and illusion spells. Yeah, probably. Let me just look here real quick, though. Whatever. Okay. Um, yeah, I guess he just takes aim at this person down here with his Eldritch Blast. <laughs> okay, and that, that person just gets destroyed, explodes into uh, uh, straw and shit, and then he uses his tentacle dude to attack. You know, he had something against this dog, so it's attacking the dog. Oh shit, it's supposed to be a d20 attack. Okay, yeah, that totally hits the dog. For seven cold damage. Oh, you guys, you guys, I'm over here. Where, where have you guys been? Are we fighting? <laughs> All right, this day, this is stupid. None of you guys are active. I guess this round will really decide if you guys come up or not. Uh, or no, you won't, will you? No. Well, we're, well if, we stay, if we stabilize, we're just at zero HP and unconscious yeah. for like an hour or something like that. I think we go back to one HP after an hour. Oh, so they it's one D four hours. Yeah. Okay. Yeah. So, yeah, you're right, yeah. though. It's an amount of time. Okay, well... Spibby... He, honestly, if I was Spibby, I would fucking bail he this would. way. Yeah. Hmm. Okay, well, you know what? Let's, let's just do something different. You guys are all unconscious. You can't do shit. Combat is technically up. You don't know what happened with Spibby. Um... You guys wake up tied up, I guess we'll say. Um, you guys are inside of the tower. I'm going to drag you over here. It was a long battle, guys. I want to see. <laughs> yeah. All right, I want to stabilize. <laughs> Oh, if you did the final death save. Mm -hmm. uh, oh, yeah, actually, uh, Randy, do your death save, too. And I just want to see. I did. I had one positive and one negative, and I, I almost didn't do it. Oh, a three. Well, no one yeah, got ones. Rolling. Yeah, keep rolling them until... All right, that's a good oh. one. That's a bad one. See what I got here. It's a bad one. That's a good one. You guys both need one more good one. I think one more bad one. <laughs> oh, okay. Xerox stable, so he didn't die. <laughs> hey, none of All right, died. so none of you would have died naturally. 
Um, but yeah, actually, after you guys passed out, they, they kind of drag you back into this tower and tie you up into these chairs. Um, and I guess all three, all three of the owners are there. No, sorry. One's dead. Um, shit. And I guess when you come to, you just overhear them talking like, well, what, how are we going to do the procedure now that she is... Uh... We don't know the part. How do we make the paint? She's dead. I... The, we have some left, so, so let's at least do them. Um, and then we'll... I guess we'll figure it out. I don't fucking... Oh, you're awake! <laughs> you thought you could get the best of us, didn't you? And I'm like, coming to... Uh, well, we got your oh. one friend, didn't we? <clears throat> Yeah, well, you did, but that wasn't enough, was it? Guess not. <laughs> well, you know, for your troubles, what? I, we're happy to pay you back in some in some way. What would, what would you what would you make better about yourself? Hmm. Better at killing you. Better at killing us. Maybe... Ugh. I... I... That doesn't sound... <laughs> he said he's joking. Alright, um... Can't can I ask for that? I, well, Anything I want? I... Well... <laughs> sure. You know what? Let's give him... It won't... It won't... Matter. I'm just kidding. I don't want anything from you guys. Oh. All right, well. I'm perfect, can't you see? What, what are we going to do with this crew here? <sighs> Spibby's not in here? Mm-mm. Okay. Nope, Spibby's not in here. Uh, and this is the room they've got. They've got an easel. I think uh, Kenjamin had kind of burst into this room before looking for you guys, but then left when you guys were talking to the gargoyle. Uh, but they're setting up an easel and like they're putting uh, like a a paint an empty canvas but the it's not like it doesn't look normal and they're putting a canvas up and they're like getting paints out of a, a chest all right you... um so we're like tied up to a chair with like rope yeah how am i too weak to try to flex and bust out of this or like can i move anything at all can i like wiggle the chair at all Sure. Uh, you know, yeah, if you want to try to bust free, just give me an athletics to try to bust out of it. Oh my god. An eight. Okay, well, hang on. Let me just see. I'm going to let them roll. Fly the hand. See how good yeah. it is. You have to kind of head out kind of soon. No, yeah, I was going to wrap it up pretty much any second now. Okay, yeah. No, unfortunately, you're it's too... You're tied up too tight to, to pull free. Um, well, let's oh. just go one by one through you guys. Yeah, it looks like Nencho is just trying to wriggle free from the ropes tied to the chair. Uh, Xerox, what are you doing? Oh, I'm... Am I still unconscious, or...? No, you, you guys have all come to... Okay. But you're just tied up to chairs in this kind of, like, art studio. <clears throat> Let me uh, give my shot here at the athletics. Okay. And work it out. So, let's see, give this a shot. Okay, so you're 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 pulling at the ropes or whatever. Uh, Kenjamin, what are you doing? Just dreaming about pizza. You're just dreaming <laughs> of pizza. Yep. Okay. Get um. Give me a persuasion roll. Like it's against yourself. Maybe I don't know. No, a performance too. I don't know. Whatever. Yeah, that's cool. You persuade yourself to think of pizza, and you have advantage on something coming up because you're so pumped. Like you've calmed yourself down thinking about these slices of pizza. Um, but yeah, actually, Xerox then busts out of the ropes. Your hands are now free. Uh, what's the last thing we do before we just hit a cliffhanger and see what happens next time? You are now free. <clears throat> like, oh. uh, 
And, <laughs> and I mean, I guess all of those those people are standing there in front of you. Hang on, let me put the dogs well, there. But I mean, be, obviously, I would untie my two buddies here. Well, you know what? We'll stop there. So, like, technically, the the people who have tied you up are standing there watching you. So they wouldn't oh. let they wouldn't let you. But you know what? Let's just no roll way. into an initiative and find out what happens. So I'm not gonna do an ice but... wind dale yet. Huh? We're not doing ice wind dale yet. Um, I think that the you're practically done with this. I'm done. I'm fine to finish this or do whatever next time. It's fine. Yeah, I mean, I I'd, I'd like for you this. to uncover what's going on here to an extent, but I do want to start Icewind Dale. I just yeah, I didn't expect this to be the battle the whole <laughs> freaking time. You know. Yeah, I mean, there's just three. Yeah, I mean, it, there's it's really probably just because there's three of us, and I don't have any offensive spells. I'm pretty much just a healer. Right. It's okay. There's well, a lot of there's a lot of dudes too. It's all good. And well, we and because like all rolls. of them had like resistance to regular attacks so like you weren't dealing as much damage the whole time well that's what i'm saying like i have like we don't have any spellcasters that's gonna do any damage i have like total right. dead but that's pretty right uh but yeah no i don't know i mean maybe we can figure out a different time to finish this i do want to start icewind dale um but yeah i mean we're practically so close to the end of this so i don't know we'll, we'll figure it out but uh, about, how long do you think it is? How long? Uh, <laughs> it's one of those things that depends on what we do, but we're it like, it does so depend close on what you do. Like, yeah, it's yeah. I don't know. I don't, it's, I don't know where, well, yeah, I don't know. That's hard to say. Sorry. <laughs> no, yeah, no worries. Cause I mean, like, I guess if it's really short, then, you know, next session would only be like an hour. Right. Well, I don't think it's really short. There's places to look. There's things. Uh, I don't know. We'll just have to see. That out. Yeah, we can see. Well, well, we just ended right here. Fucking, he bust out and shit's about and to go down. We got yeah, I'm just. Yeah. I, I want to play a different character. <laughs> I just made this in a hurry. Honestly. Uh, <laughs> I hear you. Yeah. I sorry. I know this was supposed to be quicker than. <laughs> Then it yeah, is it was one, like a one, a one shot, shot is like never four a sessions. one shot. Yeah. Yeah. Never ever is a one shot. Yeah, it's pretty yeah. Cool. <laughs> yeah. Well, so just let's get some uh, uh, some added detail from Randy. So Xerox, you bust free, and the these two elves are standing in front of you. Your two friends are tied up. What are you doing? What's your immediate thought? My uh, immediate well. Oh shit! Um, well, I do have well, I have a spell that I can disguise myself. Yeah, they'll see you change, but yeah. Yeah. Um, you still have you still have spell slots though. None. <laughs> he might. Yeah, he's got some. He wasn't casting yeah. a lot of spells. Yeah. Just cast a minor, on one of them. I don't know. Yeah, I do have. Um, Try to hit him with the hideous laughter. I know it didn't work before, but that was just because they rolled real good. Maybe. Uh... Yeah, 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 I could do that. Want me to go ahead and do that now? Sure. Yeah. I mean, target All one, right. and yeah, there you go. Come on. I think that. Yeah, that went right. It did go. Uh, yeah. All right. Yeah, and then you you finally land it. You cast I the spell. Like, she just I starts. Yeah. Giggling, I don't know what it says to you on the thing, but yeah, she just starts giggling, um, and she's just laughing. Her friend uh, starts to freak out, wide-eyed, looks back at you, and that's where we'll cut off, and we'll see what happens next time. Oh yeah, you guys have weakened their forces at the very <coughs> least, so we'll we'll just we'll see. You guys did good, good battle. It's a bummer oh, yeah. there wasn't more. Like, we started with, like, all role play, and then it was, like, all battle. <laughs> yeah. Oh, man. Yeah. Well, anyway, we'll, we'll get you a new character, Kevin. We'll, we'll get you something awesome. We'll go <laughs> yeah. back to Icewind Dale soon. I was soon. expecting just, just fucking party wipe, honestly. <laughs> yeah. It's all good. Look, we all can right. come back to this. We can come back to this later. We can do Icewind Dale next time. I'm down to start whatever. Yeah, I mean, I, I guess we'll have to see how many people we have for Icewind Dale, too, because three people, you know, I mean, it's not bad, but it's not ideal. Right. Three people can work. 
Yeah, ideally four or five, but we'll see. It just depends just, on if the battle, what's, yeah, you know, I don't know. And one, it's like, it's just more work on you, because I'm sure this module is probably balanced for like four people. Yeah, exactly. Right. Well, but part of it is that it's supposed to be scary, so it's not even really balanced for four people. So mm. like some things are supposed to be terrifying and you run away. So like technically I sure. don't, I shouldn't, or I, I might not have to adapt it too much. We'll see. Yeah, we'll see. But, but I mean, I think Hello. we got Randy and we got you, and then if we can get Alex, then we'll we'll see. So we might be good. Anyway. Yeah, right, I have well, to see what's up. I got to get in touch with him. Yeah. Well, we'll see. I mean, I know he was talking to some people about joining as well, and I just want to get a consistent group, you know, yeah. and just roll with it. So I get you. We will Thank see. You. But I like this group, so I, I can't wait to get started. Yeah, yeah. Heck yeah, man. Yeah. All right, guys. Well, All right. Cool. Catch you next week.